So you guys, I'm just filling up my kids little breakfast basket. I keep this little, um, well, it's a good size, large size basket. I keep this filled with different stuff so they can grab in the morning. So like I do like the sea bars, the different kind. So like I have in this one, I have like this, um, y'all see, I do the cinnamon roll. Then I do the chocolate chip, and then we also do the um, oatmeal cookie. I do the neutral grain bars for them. I do muffins. Um, I do all different types of things in here. Then I got the fruit snacks, Rice Krispie treats, any any little um, thing that they can have like in the morning time they like to just grab or throughout the day. So I keep this basket filled to let them know that they can just grab out this um, basket and um, get stuff. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. So, you guys, I'm just filling up this candy for Halloween tomorrow. Today is Saturday. Tomorrow is Sunday, Halloween. So, I got my candy jar that we keep into the house. So, now, I know that the um, kids is not going to be able to eat all this candy. Show all that candy. All that candy over there. They're not going to be able to eat all that candy. It's a lot. So, we're going to fill up this bowl right here with candy. And then, I'm going to fill up this jar with candy. I have a box there that I'm filling up to give to my son with candy in it. Um, they have some other little stuff like, um, let me grab this. Like they have like the um, brownie pumpkins. They're gonna eat these today. And then they also have these little pumpkin delight um, cookies. I love these too, but um, I'm kind of tired of them because I don't went through about two or three boxes of them throughout the um, week and I'm tired. So I'm gonna add all this stuff so they can have Halloween candy for tomorrow. And that's what we're going to do. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up this bag. If I can get it open. This smells so good. It's like you can smell the candy just kind of from it. So, oh, and this bag, you guys, it has the Sour Patch Kids, the Twizzlers, the Twizzlers, um, Pull and Peel. It has Jolly Rancher Hard Candy, Jolly Rancher Lollipops, J Jolly Rancher Chews, and like I said, Sour Patch Kids. So, this is a good bag. So, I'm just going to fill this up. So, there I have stuff. I'm going to put some in my candy jar as well. Get all them twisters in there. Try to mix it up. I want to get my son some of it as well. This is for my um, 22 year old son that he can take with him. This one has a lot of twisters in it. It has a lot of um, twisters in it. So I don't want to get all them twisters in here. So I see all these Twizzlers. I don't want too many um, Twizzlers. It didn't have these little candies like this, you guys. It's real small, so I'm going to have to dig in here for those ones. So those are like real small. So they had this bag right here. This was just some nerds. They already had opened this. But I'm going to throw some of those in there still. And this is a lot of candy, so I don't know how they're going to do it with this candy but it's Halloween why not enjoy we threw up some of everything um in here then we also had this bag right here and it had the little um Jolly Ranchers and all that stuff in the milk doves and the whoppers and the um what you call these the Rolos or Rollies whatever you call them and it had all these in that in there as well so I'm just gonna look at that too and this is what I like in this bag these are my favorite they have these right here in there and these are really good Super, super good. Now I'll put some in here. Try to mix them up for tomorrow. They're not going to eat this candy today. This will definitely be for um, tomorrow, but. Let me say I have some candy because they're not going to the treating. So I'll just mix it up. I'm going to put the rest of this in here. I might even get some candy away or somebody knock on my door because there's so much candy. My kids will be eating on this candy till next summertime. They're not about to get all this candy. Then they also got suckers. And then I haven't even opened the bag. Check this out, you guys. I haven't opened this bag. This got the Reese's, the sweetest fish. This is um, more Twizzlers, Kit Kats, and Reese's Pieces. I'm going to put some of this in here because... My son loves juicy pieces, so I want to make sure I get some of those in there for him. Not hope they dad don't pick up no more candy because he just happened will be out and will pick up more candy than they got. 
They got a little too much. Still come in the little packs like that. So I don't want no more twizzlers in there. It's my phone box. It's filled to the top too. But I know he would enjoy this as well. Then it has the larger size Kit Kats. So I, I love that. Because it does have the larger size Kit Kats in it. Try to get some of this in here and mix it up. Yeah, I most definitely might pass off some candy tomorrow because my kids is definitely will not eat all this candy. This is a lot of candy. Probably gonna put some in the freezer too because we I freeze candy as well, especially like candy bars and stuff. I freeze them. Okay, then they have suckers. Yeah, I think I look too much candy. Throw some suckers in there, just a few. No kids like suckers. I'll put the suckers around the corner. I can get them all in here. And then I bought some pizzas, some frozen pizzas, so they're gonna be having pizza tomorrow for Halloween. Just have pizza, have candy, and just sit back and enjoy themselves. This is one of those. These suckers right here, I don't really like them. That's these. Um, Right here, you guys. I had got these, and they are a caramel apple pop. <laughs> the caramel so hard on these suckers that you can barely, barely even like. I don't know. I don't like them. I don't know if my kids like them. But they're real hard. I'm gonna drop the candy too, y'all. That's what I thought for y'all. So you guys I have my Christmas tree and all my decorations pulled out for the Christmas tree and I think I'm gonna go ahead and start decorating the Christmas tree getting it up this is a before what you're looking at of just how everything is here the Christmas tree standing tall let's get started and check out these little squirrely hooks I got this is what I'm gonna use to hang my ornaments on they are gold and they like have a squirrel to them and I really love them so you guys my Christmas colors are going to be a blush pink also they're going to be gold with a touch of white ottomans and i think that's going to be really um pretty this year you guys and i am now just starting to decorate the christmas tree so you guys here's a look of my home for christmas here's the fireplace with the beautiful candles all lit i love it here's those pretty beautiful tree branches with the lights on them i just really love this i probably will have this forever you guys i put some lights on the fireplace as you can see everything just came together and it's just giving me that all around christmas feeling like i just feel like christmas is in the air now here's my beautiful tree the colors are so beautiful here's a little closer look at the tree let me cut the light on for you guys now you can really see my angel will not fit at the top so i still wanted to add it to the tree beautiful tree beautiful colors everything came together so beautifully So I still have a smaller angel right here on the tree and the top of the tree I added a gold beautiful flower to the top of my tree and that was really something different because I usually have a star or an angel at the top of it but all the colors are just really beautiful and the gold is just really popping for me this year. I really love it you guys.
So you guys, the second new light fixture is going up into the bathroom. My husband is about to get ready and remove the old lighting fixture and put the new lighting fixture in. As you see, he is taking it apart to take it out. I love this. They both are like black metal. I like both of them. I think they are unique and I think they are different, you guys. I'm so happy to be getting rid of this light fixture, you guys. It was so tacky looking to me, just cheap and tacky, and I did not like it. So happy for the new one. break from the light just random you guys check out my upstairs hallway going down the stairs wall very unique what i did and i love this wall okay you guys back to the bathroom light let's get it installed We're also going to be doing some touch-up paint like you can see like in the corners of the wall where the blue at you can see some of the white. So my husband is going to go around and do some touch-up painting and again we're going to paint the ceilings gray.
so you guys the light is in this is what the light on now let me show you the light is off this is how it look it's very industrial i love both of the bathroom lights the next things i need to do for the bathroom is put the new sink faucet in which that is going to turn black and then the doorknobs and then it will just be decorating but also you guys i'm going to paint the bathroom ceiling gray but this is um coming along real well you guys stay tuned for more of this bathroom renovation you guys okay y'all i'm about to get ready and clean my room up like this is my room. Look at it. Just like, let me look a little close up. Look at all that stuff. I'm putting out my dresser drawers. I need to clean out my dressers. This is my husband's closet. It's just stuff everywhere. Like, look at this. Yeah. Look at it. Look all over here. So, it is a mess. So, yeah, I'm about to get all this cleaned out. Then my closet. I need to get my closet just wiped down. Let's just see my closet is just all out of order. Look at this. Just stuff everywhere. So I need to get all this. I need to clean up the glass. I got to get my stuff ladder because I need to wipe down my glass up there where my shoes is at. Then I got other stuff taken over where my shoes are supposed to be. You see air freshener, carpet fresh, just all types of stuff. Pullers and stuff down there out of place that goes onto the bed. Just a lot of extra stuff, so yeah today is clean room day just look at all this stuff i mean like my dresser is just crazy so yeah that's what i'm doing you guys so you guys i got my room picked up as you can see the dresser is cleaned off hubby's dressers are cleaned off well his closet this is his closet his closet is cleaned off those clothes under there i got them all folded Got everything picked up, you guys. I got my closet all clean. I end up um, taking all the shoes down.